Ever since I knew Rapid Blue is a color and I saw the one Lee wheels, I liked them a lot, don't get me wrong, but I just feel like they're a little dark for this color specifically. But I really thought that there was like a gunmetal-ish color wheel with really thin spokes and it would just make the car pop that much more instead of the tires just kind of falling beneath the car as far as color and contrast goes. I fell in love a lot with HREs, but after seeing that it was like $2,000, $3,000 per rim, I was like, yeah, there's a lot better ways to spend that kind of money. So I kind of just like threw that on the back burner. I was cool with the one Lee wheels. They look great. Again, don't get me wrong. But I was checking Facebook Marketplace as I normally do, finding like camera gear, parts for the car. And I came across some HRE wheels three hours away in Pennsylvania. They're a really good price considering as well that they're wrapped in uh, Michelin Pilot Sport 4s all seasons. Even though the setup is super cheap for what this kid's selling it for, as opposed to buying it like tire and rim and TPMS. It's just a lot of money. And the other thing is that I bought a wheel and tire package for this car. And I want to know, I asked one of my friends that works at Chevy, if I bring in the OEM tire on an HRE wheel, if they'd be able to fix it or I'd be able to at least get the tires. I already bought it and I'd have to like prorate it or whatever, but it would just be a headache to go through that. And honestly, I'd rather just be able to be insured on my at least tires. So I sent the dude an offer and he gave me a decent like cut on the original price, but then Ray reached out to him for his girlfriend that has a one LE. Dude gave him a better price. Free is able to secure it and it looks good. We'll be taking a trip out there to see what's up with it. And maybe I'll come home with some HRV wheels. Till the very next day, bum, 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 bum. Obviously, since this video is still going on, we're gonna go get the wheels. I had to make a quick stop at the bank, pulled out a little bit of cheddar. We're gonna start our trek all the way to Pennsylvania. Clearly, we can't take the wheels in this. One of them would probably be in my lap as I drive and one on the roof. Ray's gonna help us out. And there he is. Wow! Absolute degenerate. My water. We gotta have a little Q&A with you. So what was your thought processing when you told him it was for your girlfriend? No, I, I, I thought it'd be funny because I was gonna be like, oh, it's a girl's car. What, what are we gonna do when we get there? We'll see, we'll see. I hope he's cool about it. I hope he's not like, nah, I don't want to sell it to you freaking weirdos. Yeah, we'll, we'll, tell, we'll tell him after. With that terrible interview out of the way, off we went to go pick up my new wheels. Quick shout out to the seller for coming out a little bit to make the deal happen sooner, but even with a shorter ride, Ray still managed to get hangry. Welcome to Taco Bell. It spilled all over me. Thank you. One more? Wanna pick up me? A picture of you? Yeah. Sure. <laughs> There's our friendly gas station guy over here. Picture. Thank you, boss. You want to see it? Yeah. You wanted to see the picture, so I had to cut it and then I had to freeze the frame on it. No, you wanted to because he, he washed the front and back windows. Oh, no. All I have is hundreds today. I'm sorry, bro. <laughs> Do they have coins? <laughs> yeah, I have some coins right here. <laughs> I would look bad anyways. Poor guy. First bite. Like to go into the left lane. Stay straight. My stability control is not working, so be careful. <laughs> <laughs> Give it a thumbs up. Line it up, line it up. DRS on that. <laughs> that wing moves. I mean, He's got I, a button uh, in there. I hope it's, I hope it's a nah, you uh, turned the plate line. Nah. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> the wing going up and down is crazy. Hey, nice to meet you, Ray. Nice to meet you, Ray. Nice to meet you. you guys. Pop these bad boys out. So what's the story? You gave up on the build or what? So I think I'm gonna get a C7 Z06. SS1 LE? Yeah. 23? 22. Two? Um, yeah. Yo, being honest with you, it's not for his girlfriend, it's for me. Okay. He just, he just no, didn't want to. I was going into work and I don't want to lose the deal, so I'm like, yo, message yeah. the guy, see what's good. I got you, know? you, yeah, for sure. They have like the temp sensors yeah, 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 yeah. in them, so you'll be good okay, there. Okay. So they work. I mean, yeah, I had yeah, never yeah. had any issues with I got them. you. 20 lugs for you with the tool. Gotcha. Yeah, these tires probably only have a thousand, two thousand miles on them. Yeah, and you said they're ceramic coated, right? Yep, ceramic coated, so Carbro they... Deluxe. And they're uh, balanced too, so you'll be all good there. Literally, you'll be able to take off your stock SS1 LE wheels, bolt these up. I even bought a tire tool off of Amazon, and you can learn up your tires right at home. Nah, I, I got the same color, so. Yeah, I saw I you. Rapid <laughs> blue is the yeah. way to go. Now they look better first. Yeah, 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 dude, honestly, I really don't want to like give them up. If I want to actually get a Z06, I got to start selling parts for the car. I was like, because I'm not going to sell the, I had a dealership offer me 65 as is, like they wanted everything with it. They wanted the wheels, the trunk, I was like, you guys aren't getting the wheels, you guys aren't getting the trunk. Like, I'm sorry, look. Not yet, looks good. Yes, sir. 
Yeah, you can count it if you want. Pretty Sounds sure it's good, man. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We were gonna have a friend. He's like, yo, I'll, I'll, I'll send him 2000 He'll definitely <laughs> accept it. Would you have taken it? No. Nah. People were hitting me up thinking I was asking $3,000 for the whole car. They were like, oh, look, I'll come this weekend, cash ready. 17, 18, I got a V6 Camaro, 2011. I thought I was the fucking man. Was your Z auto or the one you have now? Yeah, it's a 10 speed. He offered you for real? Uh, what, what was his name? I had a, like, I literally had like 20, 30 people. Uh, yeah, I do remember him. He's like, oh, I'll come like tomorrow or something. I appreciate right, it, guys. Cool. Have a safe trip back, all right? I appreciate you coming out. Of course, yeah, anytime, man. Good meeting. Nice. They're cop. Color. They look so good. Because like black wheels are played out. Like. You throwing them on today? You want to throw them on today? Back at the crib. Ray's a little fatty, so he started eating some of the guac. Got a little something myself. I got a Camaro, CRV in the cup. Better just grub, and then we'll take care of the wheels, yeah? All right, so what's the first thing you notice about these uh, <clears throat> these nuts? Oh no, they were loose. Probably like 50 foot pounds. And the crazy part is that I took it to the dealership to get the tires put on, because those are the new tires. What? Things are peeling. What things? This. <sighs> All right. I usually go on my butt. And then I put my knees under and I lift it up my knees and then I guide it with my hands. Bro, if the car falls, it's quiet. <laughs> <laughs> Make sure your legs are not under the rotor. That looks so good. Slotted rotors. Uh, one step at a time. Get them a little snug and then drop the car and we can torque these. Now we're about to see a Supra owner try to jack up a Camaro with its shitty jack points. Damn, bro. bro. Where the fuck is it? <laughs> okay, okay, right here. We'll go for the this, so this one. one is the one I would do. Time will tell, right? Yeah, time will tell. Nah, it came off that easy? Yeah, you wanna feel one? Can I do it with one finger, you think? No. Two? Thumb? One hand? That's concerning. I'll do the rear, you do the front. We do a little race. Go. Five for me. Ah. Bruh. Now I'm done. Now the crazy thing is you had to experience with those other three wheels. You gotta help me out with this one. I might have did it here. Two of them went on. It's not sitting right. It's official. I'm a one of one now. T Money would be proud. Somehow I just completely didn't acknowledge what the seller told me about the batteries and the learning tool. Tire tool, nine volt battery. I guess I was too excited to get the wheels or whatever. It's a TPMS learner tool thing. It looks like one of those vapes uh, that the kids smoke nowadays or a breathalyzer, whichever one you want to take it as. Don't be an idiot like me and forget your nine volt battery. You're going to hop in your car, turn it on. You're going to see that the light over here is going to flash and it's going to tell you, um, not that. This didn't happen immediately. It happened after like 40 something miles. You're going to want to hold that down for a couple of seconds. It's going to say tire learning active. You hear the horn honk. The order in which you're going to go in is driver side, passenger side, back right, driver side. Now you're going to come and press this button near the stem. It's going to honk when it's good. You're going to jump to the other side. I think you have like a limited amount of time to do this. Another honk and one more. Another honk. You should be all set. It's happy. It honked twice. And there you go. There's not that much else to it. This is like $8. It's better than having to go back and forth to Mavis or wherever you get your tires done um, for them to program it every time. All right, we'll take it to, I think I'll be fine for yeah, now. Let's take it to the dealership or something. I don't want you saying anything about super interiors. This is crazy. Is this aluminum? Nah, that feels like plastic too. Yeah, she's popping, she's popping. Just listen to the ride. We're not here for the inside. Watch out, pothole on road ahead. Nah, that is a canyon. Get a look at that. All right, so that's gonna pretty much be the video. It looks super good, I'm super happy with it. You think it's good? Yes. I couldn't hear what he said, but I'll probably hear it in post. Appreciate the guy that sold it to me. If you end up seeing this in one of the group chats, appreciate the, the deal you gave me. Completely love it, dude. Yeah, shout out Team Money for giving this car up. So I appreciate Ray for coming out and helping me uh, transport him and all that. He was paid in a lot of food and uh, I'm, I'm just glad we got it this quickly. I saw it on Saturday or I saw it on Thursday night. Within a, a weekend, pretty much, we got this shit on. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Make sure you sub if you like this content. You want to keep watching more stuff like this. We're going to chill out for mods for now, but uh, it's a pretty big one. Subscribe and like the video.